we now? This is called the vestry. The vet? Do you put your vest on in here? <laughs> no, not my vest. Not my vest, but my vestments. What's that? That's the special clothes that we wear oh. for when we're doing services. The special clothes we talked about outside? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So here we have the black cassock, cassock, which comes all the way down to the floor. Okay. Gets muddy when you go outside. Oh dear. And this is a surplus. It's white. It is white. Wow. And you said there were colourful things as well. There are. If I was doing a funeral... Yeah, with the graves outside. Like the graves outside, I'd wear a stole, a purple stole. Purple? Yes. Wow. So oh. it would go round my neck. Wow! <laughs> I'm wearing it. Wow, that's, that's right. really nice. So we use purple for funerals, but we also use purples purple in our time of preparation in the church here. So when we're getting ready for Christmas, in the time we call Advent, and when we're getting ready for Easter, during the time that we call Lent, I would wear purple in the services. Purple is preparation. Yeah, That's purple right. is preparation. That's oh, very that's good. good. <laughs> I like this one. What other colours do you have? Shall I take that one off? Yeah. I was wearing it. I know you are. What are our colours? We're going to find out. Wow. We have white. A white one. She's just got a plain cross on this one. It's just a cross. Yeah. And we would wear that for weddings. Weddings when people get married. Da, 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 da. Yeah, OK. And for baptisms. Yeah, with the font. That's right. We've already talked about that, yeah, haven't we? Yeah, with the font. Yeah. Or we'd wear it for the celebrations of the church here. Celebrations? When we have our special services at Easter <gasps> and at Christmas. Oh, Christmas presents! <laughs> what other colours have we got? A purple one and a white one. Yes, that's right. And now a green one. This is for the ordinary seasons of the year. <clears throat> so all the times when it's not a special time, we wear green. Green? It's got a bird on it. It's got a bird on it. A though. bird on it, yes. It's a dove. A, do a do In the story of Noah again! This one's even got the twig in its mouth it when it came got back. It a twig. Yes. <laughs> That's clever. But the bird also reminds us about the Holy Spirit, how we need the Holy Spirit to help us know Jesus. Wow! <coughs> so there's just one more colour. <gasps> what colour is this one going to be? It could be uh, an orange one or a yellow one or a, a blue one or a, I don't know what colour. Well, let's have a look, shall we? Oh, and have a look. <gasps> it's a red one! It's not quite the same red as your shirt. No, it's red like me. It's not quite. <laughs> I'm going to put it on. Yeah, go on then. Ta da Oh, wow. twisted. This one's got a cross on it, look, but it's a funny cross yeah. because that side of it's like a whole cross and that side of it's all broken up. Why is that? It reminds us that in the cross, the broken world is mended and made whole. Oh! So it's about us being healed by Jesus. It's a special symbol. It is a special symbol. <laughs> That's nice. It's a red one. It is a red one. Yeah. With a gold cross. And we use it just a few times in the year for Pentecost and Trinity. And sometimes in some churches we also use it in November for what we call the kingdom season. When we remember that Jesus is the king. Wow. Or Christ so, the king. Wow, that's good. So you're wearing, wearing a special services. Wow, that's fantastic. I really enjoyed it. I know you've really enjoyed it. But Jack, we have had a great time here. Probably need to go back and make sure Grandad's okay. So let's take this off you then, shall we? Yeah. Put it away and then we can go outside. Yeah, but well, we've got to go home. We have got to go home. I want to stay here though. I know, but we do have to go make sure Grandad's okay. Oh, okay then, let's go. Wow, what a fun trip. It was great, I really enjoyed it. <laughs> I'm glad you enjoyed it. Wow, what do you need to say? Um, 
good boy. Yeah, but before that, when someone does something nice for you and shows you around, you need to say, oh, I need to say thank you. Thank you very much. It's been great. I've enjoyed it. Well, thank you for coming. Wow. Well, Jack, we do need to go now. So, uh, so uh, will, you, will you say goodbye? Oh, OK. Good boy. I'm going to come okay. again. Will you come again? That'd be good. I'm going to come with Grandad. Would Grandad like to come here? Yeah, I think he would really enjoy it. And I would like it because you've got toys. <laughs> I might come on a Christmas and an Easter day with the I eggs. Chocolate. Yes, OK. <laughs> anyway, I've got to go. Yeah, we've got to go. So say goodbye. Yeah. Goodbye. Goodbye. Oh, goodbye. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you very much. You're very welcome. Let's go. Let's go.